Let's do a little experiment. Say I asked you, as soon as you finish watching this video, to go ask your next three patients to refer to your practice. What's your initial reaction? Is it, oh, I can do that all day, every day, no problem? Or is it more like, I would rather crawl under a rock and be in the dark by myself the whole rest of the day? <laughs> or is it somewhere in between? It's really important to frame this question to your team when building your referral asking culture within the practice. Here's why. You'll have people who are on the end of the spectrum, like your front office manager, who is really you know, gregarious, outgoing. She, he or she will ask all day long, every day, and not even think about it. Oftentimes when I deliver this training to dental practices nationwide, the hygienists, the dentists, uh, other uh, back of the house folks are a little more shy about it. And that's okay. I encourage you to meet them where they are. So with your more outgoing people, encourage them and reward them to ask as much as possible. With your more reserved folks, encourage them to look for moments of connection in the practice when a patient compliments you, when a patient thanks you, when a patient gives you a thank you card, which I know happens often in practices like yours. That's that moment of connection, and it's the cue to that person, here's where I deliver my one-liner, is how I like to think of it. So that one-liner could be, thank you, and know that we're always accepting new patients. It can just be that simple. And when you complement your external marketing with a really strong referral marketing culture, your marketing return on investment rises like like no other. You're sitting on a little gold mine, is what I always say. So start asking and watch the results roll in.